Hi everyone, welcome to Sean Allen Films The Educational Series. I'm Sean Allen. This is part 5 of a 9 part series on the skeletal system. If you haven't seen parts 1, 2, 3, and 4 yet, I suggest you go watch them right now. In today's video, we're going to be looking at the limbs. That's right, the arms and the legs. Let's take a look at the bones in your arms. Say, did you happen to know that you only have three bones in each of your arms? Well, it's true. Oh, and we're not even including the hands or your shoulder. So, in reality, in both of your arms, you have up to six bones. One, two, three, four, five, six. See? Six bones. The bones in the arm are as follows. This bone, which is attached to your scapula, is called the humerus. No, it has nothing to do with being funny. So, be quiet! The humerus is connected to two other bones in your arm. They are the ulna and the radius. Do you know what is interesting about both of these bones? Well, they help you twist your arm around. It also twists your wrist. If you want to learn more about the different movements of your skeleton, be sure to check out part 8 of the skeletal system. Trust me, you don't want to miss that one. Okay, so now that we have finished looking at the bones in your arms, let's now look at the bones in your legs. Oh, by the way, we'll be discussing about the bones in your hands and feet in the next episode. The first bone we'll look at is the femur. This is the largest bone in your body. This bone is also known as your thigh. The bone below the femur is called the patella. This is also known as your knee. This is the bone that helps you move your leg. And just like your arm, there are two bones connected to the femur. They are called the tibia and the fibula. Okay, well that's it for the limbs. Let's do a quick review. Your arm contains three bones, the humerus, the ulna, and the radius. Your leg contains four bones, the femur, the patilla, the tibia, and the fibula. Remember that the femur is the largest bone in the human body. Well everybody, we are finished with part five of the skeletal system. Yeah, it was a little fast, but hey, you can always review the video in case you forgot something. Next week, we're going to be discussing about the bones in your hands and your feet. Before you go, be sure to like this video and leave a comment telling us what you thought about today's show. Be sure to also check out Sean's Google Plus page, Twitter, Keek, Facebook, and Second Channel. The links are down below. Well, that's it for today. Until next time, yep, keep on learning.